civil disobedience in my town. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, oh, thank goodness you're here, Sheriff. Things were getting out of hand. Oh, uh, come right in, Sheriff. Hey, now, let me have a gander at the source of the societal discontentment here. <laughs> All right, listen up. I've been thinking, and I believe I've figured something out. You folks have a water problem. Now just pay attention, everybody. I'm trying to make a point here. Let's say this fella here were to take a drink of water. Just one little drink, no harm, no foul, right? <laughs> and you! <gasps> Why, you're just as dried up and parched as a jackrabbit in July. So you belly on up and take you a double shot. <sighs> Stay with me. <sighs> what do you think happens then? Why, we'd all be drinking. And before you know it, there wouldn't be any more water. And then where would we be? We'd be thirsty. Real thirsty. Why, we'd turn on each other like a bunch of animals. Now, look here. We have got six days of water. We have got five days. As long as we've got water, we've got ourselves a town. Sheriff Rango is right. As long as we have this water, we have some hope. And you can all take it from me. My 100% full-time employment from this moment on will be to protect our precious natural resource. Ain't no one gonna tango with the Rango. Yeah.